So some of you guys that don't know, I have a Jeep Wrangler. Didn't pass inspection. Failed on the wheel hub that I gotta replace. I got a hole in the floorboard from rust. Yeah, I gotta fix that somehow. But I'm gonna start on the wheel hub, it should be pretty easy. I got all my tools here. Got my Bridget gun. Shout out to Bridget. Love that thing. WD-40. Hint, tint. I got a seal. And I got the wheel hub. And then I got some of this. Maybe use that for the hole in the driver's side. But I will start taking her apart. My dad's over there. Uh... Grinding the floor for me. <laughs> There's a little safety tip if you can hear me. Stick your tire under the frame so it doesn't hit the ground. <laughs> that way if this now, now lands on the tire and you can at least get it back up off the ground. <laughs> It did say right side, right? I don't know. I don't. I think they're fudging with me. All right, stand by, team. We're looking at the paperwork to see if I'm doing the right side. Front axle seal, front hub, right. Remove and replace front axle seal, front hub assembly. All right. Paperwork says that. Using that WD-40. Maybe they'll sponsor us. Oh, she was tight one. Got the BFH. Woo! Get it? Yeah. What do you guys think? You think that sounds shitty? I think so. Shit. Let's compare. It up in Let's compare it to this one. I can't even spin this one. And it doesn't sound like. <laughs> it doesn't sound like grind, shit. Grinding coffee. <laughs> Make sure the lugs line up. There's your axle. Or the cheap Wrangler axle. Got another rigid tool. I think the last time I used this, I dinged my hand. Zink. I know I'm stupid having my fingers as close to him. <laughs> See where I learned all my cool shit from? This guy right here. Oh, and uh, look who's showing up. The one who's been driving my Jeep. He gets to go to the gym while I get to work on it because I guess it's not his car. Talking shit? Yeah, man. 
What? You, you getting mad that I'm off roading or not? Yeah, man. I tried, man. It's fun to drive. Evan, what are these? So you didn't put a jack stand? You don't know. Uh, you got your tire. I guess you're okay. You don't know. Oh, he got it. Evan, all I'm saying is your shit just doesn't break as much as ours, so you don't have to fix it. I also don't want to do anything to that car. Here you go, beautiful. Thanks, buttercup. Torque them to 75 foot-pounds. Goes. I think you got it flipped. Son of a bitch! <laughs> well, flip and you learn. So close. You know the funny thing is, when I do work on stuff, at least I don't put it on backwards. <laughs> Kids got jokes. That's better. I was right there anyway, the gun did it, I guess. Yeah, got him. All right, that part's done. Got to do the floorboard. Working on the floorboard now. Got to repair that. My dad found back of a computer. Instead of running around and getting sheet metal, I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna trace it out here. See how this goes. So, something along this line. I guess I'll cut that out first and see. Rigid. Got one of the sides for it. That's not too bad. It looks like I need to cut it to here. 
and come down. Pull that there. Cut that lip off. This hat. Uh, uh, it's probably okay. Let's see how we do. Alrighty. Clean these edges up a little bit. See how we do here. Not too bad. I think, I think it's just gotta come up like here. I would cut a little further down, make this go up a little bit more. Like Maybe right get in. it closer there. Yeah, that's what I meant. Cut this out. I think my marker's on the table over there. Yeah. Or do that. No way of a fabricator, so don't be hating on me. All I'm trying to do is fix that hole, which I don't know if you can really see. I'm trying to fix that hole. Something like that, so it passes inspection. Kind of bend it up here. Damn, that fripped pretty damn good. I just kind of Picked it up and bent it to the floor real quick. Feel it. I don't think it. I think it's fine now. Is it okay to cover that plug? Yeah, I got that other plug there. Yeah, I guess I could cut that out too. But how close is that to the hole? I think it'll work. I think it'll work. I already have a hole there to rivet. Yeah, it's true. Just drill a couple holes. Mhm. Mm okay, maybe put a hole here, here, put a hole here, put a hole. Here, here, over in this corner. Yeah, let's bend it. Caulk it and start popping. I'm going to drill the holes out. You put this in, do we want to put caulk on it now? Or do you want to? seal it all the way around afterwards I think what's the caulking gonna do keep stuff from coming up under it uh, Probably like right. a gasket sealer or something yeah. i'm i'm getting abundance of them rigid batteries more rigid somewhere wherever the name is ah, right there rigid i got a rigid sawzall in a milwaukee case Wow, I've never used a rivet gun before. That's cool as shit. Here, do you have another hole? I pulled it tight, didn't I? Yeah. And now it'll hold there while you drill the other holes. All right, guys, keep drilling, I guess.
Check it out. Got it all riveted in. Hopefully that'll do. Pass inspection. I think I'm just gonna get some kind of rubber. There's supposed to be a plug here. What happens when it rains and you run this or it leaks, remember it leaked from up that's, under the dash? That's why I said if you just put it there and silicon it in. Yeah, look, there's a hole over here. Right where the drain plug is. This is the drain plug for it. Just run some gasket sealer around the edges here and then call it. You know what we're doing <laughs> in a way i call this the redneck way of doing it it's just a floor and it's in a jeep who cares she ain't a mall crawler well she has been for a little bit i haven't really taken her off road in a while i've been busy I think that's about it and I'm almost running out of battery as it is. Ain't a professional, but I think it'll do. I'll paint it up, let, let the gasket sealer dry a little bit. That's my girl, one of them. So, got the hub on, she all solid now. Here's the old one, that don't sound good. Oh, there you go. Like my dad said, sounds like grinding coffee. All right, I'd like to thank Rigid, not really because they don't sponsor me yet, or don't sponsor me rather. I got all their tools and use them all to do my job. Probably won't show you the spray paint because it's not that big of a deal. You guys watched it, thanks for watching. Follow us on Instagram, subscribe, like, all that good stuff. And uh, we'll see you in the next one. Peace.